right, it is October 1st, which means all those advent calendars are going to start shipping by the end of this month. And uh, my upload schedule has gone for an utter toss with all these advent calendar spoilers and price breakdown videos. And today, I mean, but we're nearing the end of it. I have no idea when I'm going to post all my reviews. You know that I've got the Charlotte Tilbury Airbrush, uh, Airbrush Flawless Foundation, uh, including a couple of demos, wear tests and uh, comparisons with the Magic Foundation. I've got the Huda Beauty Lifeliner, the throwback collection, so much to review. I have no idea when I'm going to fit all that in. But today, I am not going to do any of those things. I am going to talk about the Grazia Beauty Advent Calendar, which has launched today. And uh, this is £85. There is a discount code G-R-A-Z-A-C-5. All capitals, GRAZAC5, AC Advent Calendar, of course. I will have the link in the description box below, which means you can get it. For 80 quid and the contents are worth 326 pounds this is grazia's first advent calendar and they are launching it on latest in beauty like l did last year so the packaging looks like this canary yellow they're very bright very vibrant and there are 24 products inside this advent calendar of these seven are full-sized so i'm going to tell you the contents and while i do that i'm going to talk about the prices of the full size products alone as usual so that we can see if the full sizes come up to the cost of this advert calendar 85 pounds we're not going to count the discount either uh you get it for 80. this discount is valid only until october 13th so if you want one rush and uh the uh, in my opinion you know as i've been saying repeatedly uh the full size products alone should come up to the cost of the advent calendar itself because you know i think you should pay only for full size products all the minis all the samples all the deluxe sizes all the travel size products should come free as a gift with purchase because you know when you go to a beauty counter you pay for full size products you don't pay for samples they give you samples clarence for instance they give you samples free when you buy so in my book you should only pay for the full size products so off we go Anastasia Beverly Hills liquid lipstick in the shade Ashton, a beautiful brick neutral colour, full sized product, retails at £20. So we already have £20 of the 85. Omorovica illuminating moisturiser, 30 mils is what you get, full size is 50 mils. So you're only getting 30, we're not going to count the cost of this one. OPI nail lacquer, uh, one of three pink shades will be what you're getting full size this is and it retails at 13 pounds 50. codate precision liquid eyeliner in carbon black also a full size product 28 pounds wow 28 pounds for a liquid liner pen that has to be the most expensive liquid liner so so far three full size products out of four and we have 61 pounds 50 already 20 pounds the abh liquid lipstick opi nail lacquer 13 50 and the eyeliner 28 quid so we already have 16 pounds 50 sorry 61 pounds 50 pence i know the excitement's uh, got to my brain eh? so far already and we have another 20 products to go next thing clean reserve suede edp five mils not going to count that santrope self tan purity face mist 14 mils. This is one product in this advent calendar. There's another one coming shortly, which I'm not too excited about because, you know, I don't use fake tan. Uh, Aurelia Probiotic Skin Care, Cell Repair Night Oil, and you get 15 mils. Malin and God's Advanced Renewal Cream, 7 mils. Philip Kingsley PK Prep Perfecting Spray, 15 mils. NARS, no, 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 it's not, you know what. No satin lip pencil in the shade Rikujian, 1.7 grams. I'm, you know, thrilled that this isn't a mini or custom blush or a Laguna bronzer or a duo of the two. Well done. Aromatherapy Associates Forest Therapy Bath and Shower Oil, 9 mils. This works Sleep Together Calming Spray, 10 mils. Dermalogica Pre Cleanse Oil, 30 mils. Dago Dalla Palma Geisha Lift Concealer, 3 mils, full sized, £17.50. Uh, this is the second product in this advert calendar that I'm a bit iffy about because um, the shade, you know, I'm, I'm NC37 and I'm pretty sure that the shade sent out is going to be paler. 
Dr. Popo original balm, 25 ml, is the full size. Retail price, £6.95. Done. We've reached £85.95 pence so far. So far, 15, 15th product, we've reached £85.95 pence with one, two, three, four, five products. So five products in the Zadvant Canada come up to £85.95 pence, and we still have another nine to look at. Well done. Good value. That the same fake tan. I'm not too excited about other concealer, but maybe you know somebody paler than I obviously is going to be able to pull off that concealer. Bare Minerals Skin Longevity Vital Power Infusion, seven point five mils. Silk and Rejuvenating Day Cream, twenty mils. System Professional Lux Oil Reconstructive Elixir, thirty mils. You know I'm really liking the uh, sizes of the Advent calendar. Twenty mils, thirty mils, fifteen mils. Nice. And here we go, proving me wrong. <laughs> Darfan Vetivir Oil Mask, 5 ml. Spectrum CO3 Brush in Malachite, Blush Brush. Uh, full size, retails at £8.99. The brush looks gorgeous. Lixia Skin Electrogel Cleanser, 30 ml. Full size is 100 ml. Velida Skin Food, 10 ml. Paula's Choice Skin Perfecting 2% BHA Liquid Exfoliant, 30 ml. Full size is 118 ml. They do sell a discovery size at uh, 30 ml, and that retails at £10, but we're not going to count that. Nip and Fab Glycolic Fix Exfoliating Mask, one mask, 18 grams, full size, retails for £5.49 by itself. So the total. ABH Liquid Lipstick 20, OPI Laka 13.50, the eyeliner 28 pop, the concealer 17.50, the, the Dr. Pawpaw Balm 6.95, Spectrum Brush 8.99, and the Nip and Fab Mask 5.49. Together, these come up to £100, 43 pence, and you only pay 85 for the Advent Calder 80 if you buy it before the 13th of October with the code. Bras AC5. All capitals. Now, how do I feel? Two products, the fake tan and the concealer, which is going to be too paid for me, that I can't use. Everything else, really nice. Some very new inclusions in here. Uh, really, really like that it, they've included a nice lip pencil instead of an orgasm mini. You know, this one reminds me of last year's L Advent Canada, only that one cost 120 25 This one, 85 quid, you get a discount, 80 quid actually. And you know, very new products. It reminds me a great deal of last year's L Advent calendar. New curations, well thought out products, well done. And uh, I don't know how much of the curation was by Grazia and how much was by Latest in Beauty, but whoever did it, it's done very. I think they've looked at, uh, you know, other Advent calendar or maybe uh, listened to people. Maybe they thought, you know, all right, all these samey products over and over and over. Let's add some new things. That's the whole point of an advent counter to try out new things, you know. This is a very nice curation. And in my opinion, this is at least as good as Feel Unique's advent counter this year. Slightly better, I would say, in terms of uh, the contents and, you know, the full sizes included and uh, the brands included. Of course, there's no eyeshadow palette in here. Feel Unique has a Huda Beauty uh, Topaz uh, Obsessions eyeshadow palette. And this one does not actually have any eyeshadow, really. Yeah, no eyeshadow in here, surprising. But you know, in my book, these two are heading this year's list of mid range advent calendars. I would grade Grazia a smidgen above Feel Unique, but that is subjective. You know, if you're uh, into eyeshadows more, you might love uh, Feel Unique more because of the Huda Beauty palette. On the other hand, you know, this one has an ABH liquid lipstick, full size, and so on. So I. For me, this one is a bit nicer than Feel Unique's Advent Calendar, but this is very subjective. Either way, no doubt these two are heading the mid-range Advent Calendars of this year. We still have uh, spoilers to come for a couple more, so Bridges and uh, Beauty Expert. So let's see how those two do when they come out. Now this one, as I said, launched today, October 1st. I expect it to sell out. 80 Five pounds is the price. You get a five pound discount code with Graz AC5. 
which I will link in the which I will put up in the description box below, including where to buy. Now, as far as I know, here's the disappointment. Latest in beauty only ships to the UK. And here's another downer. The shipping within the UK costs £3.95. So I'm not sure if Grazia will sell this via, you know, another website like Elle does, you know, for Hearst. They sell it via Hearst. Uh, uh, last year they sold via Hearst as well as on Latest in Beauty. So one of them uh, was actually shipping to the EU, I believe. I've heard a couple of people say they got it, but I'm not sure if they got it. Uh, through a forwarding agency or directly from the website. I just know that somebody from France said they got it. So what are your thoughts on this advent calendar? Is there any product that you cannot use? Are you thrilled with it? Does it not remind you of last year's L advent calendar? The unboxing of which I will link in the description box below. You can also see that uh, over there. And, uh, you know, will you be getting this? Do you think it's worth it? Do you think that advent calendars should be, you know, curations of new products to try out or you know old favorites that you can keep on using without repurchasing do let me know all of that in the comments below so that's all from me for today thank you for watching this video please do give me a thumbs up please do hit the subscribe button and please do ring the notifications bell and i will speak to you soon